Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernard from the BJ Tech News and another exciting first boot of Linux. Yes, uh, I not too long ago started a playlist of uh, my adventures with first boots and also impressions of Linux. There's more than one op one. There's more than one Linux operating system, and uh, I'm always finding out that the Linux and Unix world is it's big. Uh, someone introduced me to or mention elementary OS which is uh, free and but there's also you could download it for 10 bucks I don't know what the difference is with the free and the 10 bucks you know is it a difference I don't know uh, but for those that have seen this or used this what's the difference between the ten dollar one and the free one because I downloaded the free one and it tells you what elementary OS is and I also before I even get into that uh, I want to actually give a big shout out to uh, X Street 1985 because this is the person that actually mentioned Elementary OS Luna to me. Uh, they left a comment on my first boot of of another operating system, a Linux operating system, and they left me with that. So why not check it out? And uh, he basically said that it's super fast, real easy and simple to use. And from the description that it's telling me. Uh, I don't know it looks like it could be fast but again I've never used it so I downloaded it and we're gonna do a first boot together like always like a huge family so I'm doing everything as a virtual machine as always so I'm gonna power on my virtual machine and let's do a first boot together how awesome is that hopefully it boots up there it goes boots up first thing that I, when I saw this is like the bottom part right here it looks a little bit like Ubuntu even though the guy did mention on the comment that it, it feels more like Ubuntu the way it flows and everything uh, pretty cool thing about this is as soon as you boot into it it boots into the desktop quickly again I don't know if it it would boot up on a hardware like if I had a physical machine but on the virtual machine it only takes a while like always so let's see how it looks. Ooh, look at that. Nice and pretty. Some, a nice little scenery. Uh, right to the start. Again, like every Linux operating system, they, they give you a taste of it before you are before you install it into a physical machine. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna install it. Let's install it. Let's install elementary OS. And uh, yes, yes, yes. I'm not going to do any updates. I'm going to leave that as is. I'm going to hit continue. I do want to erase the OS. Uh, yes, install now. So far, everything looks pretty, pretty fast. I'm kind of excited. New York. Let's hit continue. Uh, English is the keyboard layout for me. I don't know about you guys. So we're going to hit continue. And let's give it a name. I'm going to go to the BJ Tech News. Uh, and this one would be, computer name would be BJ elementary elementary Watson <laughs> uh, let's give it a password it's always good that you put a password into your Linux box there it goes uh, right now I'm gonna do login automatically but if you guys don't want to do that hey you could do a required password again this is only a testing environment so who cares uh, hit continue and um, I guess we have to wait wait until it's finished installing and reboots and we're gonna play around with it and see how it looks and we're back yes uh, believe it or not installation didn't take more than five to ten minutes that's pretty awesome I think that's a record uh, right now it's telling me to restart and I'm gonna restart it with you guys and it's gonna boot into the environment I think it just popped me or did a boop sound and uh, looks like it's doing all this thing. I, it wants me to remove the CD. Oh, 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 oh. Go to settings. We're going to remove the CD. Press OK. And we're going to hit enter. Awesome. So it's rebooting. Once it reboots, it's going to log in and log in automatically into our elementary OS Luna operating system. Again, this is the first boot, first impression. And so far, so good. I'm, I'm, I'm loving the way it looks. I'm loving the way it feels and uh, the installation time is amazing installation time took no more than five to ten minutes which was pretty quick I think it's quicker than Ubuntu so I want to know what you guys think about that uh, what's the quickest Linux OS operating system out there for an installation process uh, so far in my eyes I think elementary OS is one of the 
fastest one. I'm already in it. This is pretty cool. So it has a nice little uh, docking feature like the Mac. I'm always comparing the Mac to them. Uh, let's see if we can get into system settings and we can change the display. Oh my God, this is, this is, it's running extremely fast. I don't know. It's, I'm probably slow itself. Press apply. Ah, this is 14 by that. All right, I'm liking this one. I keep it this way. Boof, good job. Uh, so I don't know what that unknown is. Keep that. Keep it. Okay. I get out of this. Oh, that's pretty cool. I don't know what this unknown thing is. Okay, close. Awesome. Uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. So far, so good. Uh, I mean, it runs extremely fast. Got the terminal. Love the terminal. Awesome. Love. Oh man, this is cool. Uh, what else does this bad boy got? Uh, update manager, document viewer, cool movie player. Does it play Flash? Huh. Let's see if it plays Flash. Where is the browser? So I'm assuming this is the browser because it has a little world. So let's double click on this browser called Ma something. So it is the browser. And let's see if this bad boy has flash enabled because sometimes these things don't have flash. So I'm just going to delete this. Let's go to youtube.com and let's go into my channel. Yeah, I'm advertising my channel. Who cares? Ha ha ha. And let's see if it plays it. If it plays it, that's pretty awesome. If it does, oh, it looks like it's playing. Well, I hear it, but I don't see it. Missing the plugin, it doesn't come with Flash Player. Sad face, that sucks. But uh, I was able to hear it, which is pretty strange. Uh, it has some weird mailing clients. I think this is uh, Empathy is probably a messenger client, calendar, music like iTunes. Uh, from my understanding, when I was reading up on this, the music app actually uh, talks to your iPhone, which is pretty interesting. I would like to test that out. Uh, what is this? Shotwell. Don't know what Shotwell is. Let's just load it up. Uh, photos. Cool. It's like uh, libraries. Like in the Mac. The Mac has libraries. So I'm assuming Shotwell for elementary OS is that. I think the elementary OS is like a cheap version of Mac OS. That's, that's how I see it, which is pretty cool, pretty interesting. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoy the first boot, first impression of. Elementary OS, thank you so much, X Street 1865. Hopefully, I said that right. If you guys have any uh, questions or concerns, hey, or if you use this operating system, hey, leave comments below. Let me know what you think. Also, do not forget about hitting that like button before you head out. And I catch you guys on the next first boot. Peace out.